In this video, I'm going to teach you how to add a hyperlink in GoDaddy Website Builder. It's a very quick and easy process, so make sure to follow along. In this video, I'm going to give you easy to follow instructions on how to find the options related to hyperlinks in the GoDaddy Website Builder and how you can go about managing them. So of course, open the actual dashboard for your website, choose the option to add it, and you will be redirected to the Website Builder itself. Now, once you are in your website builder page, all that you have to do is highlight any specific text which you would like to apply a hyperlink for. It can be literally anywhere on the page. For this example, I'm going to select this description here. You will notice that immediately upon highlighting any sort of text on your page, this menu will appear at the top and usually you will have this little link icon. When you have this link icon, it means that a hyperlink can be attributed to this specific test text input. So just click this hyperlink icon and you will be able to link it to different options. So you have page, website URL, phone and email. If you select page, you can use this text to redirect you to other pages on your website. So for example, I only have the home page and then privacy policy. I could redirect to the privacy policy when the user clicks on this text. But of course, I assume most people will want to set up an alternate website URL and all that you have to do now is include the URL here. Now, I don't actually have any pages that I want to redirect this to, but for example, I'm going to just go ahead and include GoDaddy. Now, once you include any website URL, just click OK and it is now set. You can take it away by clicking on this option and as you can see, it was now cleaned, but I'm actually going to leave it here to showcase it, but this is all you have to do. Any text that you highlight and the option appears, you will be able to assign a hyperlink into. So if I publish the website and I go ahead and I try to preview it, I'll be able to use this as a hyperlink according to what I've set it to. And like you saw, there were four options, page, website, URL, phone or email. So it can be a very useful feature and you will be able to change this at any time when you highlight any sort of text on your page. I hope I was able to help you on how to change hyperlink or how to add a hyperlink in GoDaddy Website Builder. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.